and I have in fact altered the design to have a piece of elastic. Now one little thing you have to be aware of, this is a historic bag. And the pilgrims would carry this, toiling their weary way over Canterbury, hills, valleys and vales. And the rain would be coming down, and they'd be getting soaked. Suddenly, Mummy Pilgrim had a bright idea. She emptied all the garbage out of her bag, upended it, whacked it on her head, and instantly, she had the rain hat. Now, you don't have to do this, but let me show you, very simply, before Ur comes along and does her bit, how you make the Pilgrim script. Well, I don't tell as good a story as Jenny, but I would like to share a couple of things with you. I'm sure that you, like me, are tempted by little bundles of fabric like this. These happen to be from Oakshot, and they are just so scrummy. They are an eighth of an inch, uh, eighth of an inch, they are an eighth of a meter each, and you kind of pick them up because you love them, but then you say, but what can I do with these? Well, the clever people of Oakshot have said, you can make a tote bag 